Hello YouTube and welcome to another edition of the Lambo Jackson channel. Today, following a Packer loss, when I'm down, when the Packers lose huge games like this, when they probably should have won the game, I like to look at some Packer autographs. And today we'll look at half of my Packer collection that's displayed on the walls. Starting off, my collection is a Robert Brooks Lambo Leap photo. This was signed in person for me. As you can see, added the inscription Lambo Leap, pretty cool. This one right here is the infamous Golden Tate touchdown slash interception by MD Jennings. MD Jennings signed that. Over here we have Brett Favre with Mike Holmgren. Over here is one of my own creations, the Tony Mandrich, We Shall Never Forget collection. There's a signed photo of Tony. The old Sports Illustrated Incredible Bulk cover, followed by the NFL's Incredible Bust Sports Illustrated cover. Next up is a 20 by 24 of Brett Favre. Number 222 of 444. It's the my way. If I had it my way, there would be no punting on fourth down, no throwaway passes. I would never be told to slide or step out of bounds. Safeties would learn to fear my footsteps. And history books wouldn't refer to me as a quarterback, but as a football player. Over here, this is not signed. It's just a cool canvas of clay chasing Favre. Over here is a photo of Donald Driver and Brett Favre. Over here is our nice Ray Nitschke autograph photo. As you can see, Ray would always put huge inscriptions with his autograph. One of my favorites right here is Ron Wolf signed photo during the Reggie White signing press conference. Next up is a 16 by 20 signed by Jerry Kramer. And he did add the following inscription. As you can see, you don't do things right once in a while. You do them right all the time. It's a pretty tough one to find there. Over here is a pretty cool lithograph signed by Willie Davis and Reggie White. Hard to find authenticated Reggie White items. This is one of them and it's in paint pen, so you don't have to worry about it fading over time. Willie Davis and then signed by the artist in pencil. Next up is one of my favorites. It's the Mudhead Forrest Gregg. As you can see, he added his jersey number, 75, classic photo. And rounding out the first part of this series is another one of my favorites, the Vince Lombardi Upper Deck Portraits from 2005. This is numbered five out of five. As you can see, that's signed by Vince Lombardi. It's an old Packers check and also had the old Packers president as well. 